hi welcome to lady yeti kitchen today we're gonna be making a goosey jebu but before we started let's get the grilled fish out of the way so this is the fish already cleaning with lemon and vinegar so i'm gonna put seasoning to it just salt seasoning and we're gonna grill it and that's it I'm just gonna mix this together, just shake it together like that. I just wanna add a little bit of uh, oil to it. That's it. Just a little bit. So I have my baking pan over here. You just wanna grease this so that the fish won't stick to the grilled tray. Just wanna grease that with the oil. Any oil you have, that'll be good. At this point you already pre to your oven to so 350. Alright so we're gonna put in the oven for like 30 to 40 minutes. So I see you back in 40 minutes. Okay, so these are some of the recipe for Egusi Jebu. I have three tablespoons of crayfish. I have one cup of a grounded Egusi. I have, this is Iru Locust Beans. I have one tablespoon. And I have six one more over here. Maybe like medium size or small size. I have six of them. Okay, so I have one and a half cups of red and white onions. I mix them together. And I have one cup and one quarter cup of um, chopped bell pepper. And I have scotch bonnets over here. So when it comes to pepper, it's, you could just do you if you have zero tolerance for heat. So you could just put a little bit of pepper, but for me, I like my food to be spicy a little bit, just a little bit. So I have one cup and one quarter cup of chopped bell pepper. And we have our red oil. We have our red oil over here. Ready, So we want to add the local beans to the pepper as well because we want smooth agusi uh, soup. We want it smooth so you want to blend everything but we're not going to blend the season to it now. this cook for about 15 minutes and I will add one more to it. Okay. 
All right, so this is what we have about an hour, yeah, an hour later. So that Back again. And I'm gonna add more water to it. Into it. I don't need to have salt because um, salt is already in the agusi, the dry agusi to preserve it. And I'm gonna hold at this time so that the parma will be able to cook with the agusi very well. I would advise to make your own uh, grill fresh at home. This piece is so good that I already had two out of it. And now I'm confused. Should I eat fish with Gary or make swallow? Because the fish is so good. Well, I'm gonna have to decide. home a jackica or whatever fish you prefer if you can if you if possible try to make it at home by yourself you know it's clean it takes better you know how you clean it you know what you put it in there so I'm gonna let this cook for about two, 10 more minutes and I'll be that the fish didn't break because we already grilled it. Ready, 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 ready. Let me know what do you like to eat your ekusi with? You see, eba. I know some in Japan like to eat this with eba. Let me know what is eba or fufu or plantain uh, flour. I'm gonna eat it with plenty of flour. Let me know. Here you have it. Thanks for watching. And I will see you next time. Bye for now.